I push on an item conduit? Oh, yeah, there you go. Ooh. He's a good boy. <laughs> yeah, they, they went to the they went to the moon, and the first thing they found on the moon was sand. No. They tested it. It was from Mallorca. Wait, what? Are you joking? <laughs> Is this a lie? It's a lie. You're lying. I'm pretty sure that's a lie. Okay, okay, shut up. He's not, he doesn't do this often, so it's weird. It's very weird. I'm currently shipping sheep into the penthouse. Um, will they just wander down the lift shaft and kill themselves? Possibly. I would put a fence there just to stop them from doing that. All right. I mean, think about real life. Would you keep a bunch of sheep just next to, like, a giant pit? I mean, that's kind of where sheep live naturally, isn't it? On, like, hills. Steep hill back cliffs. Yeah, they steep, love it. They steep love hills mountains. aren't the same as a pit. Would you just, well, if you had a field of sheep, would you dig like a 50 foot pit with sheer walls and just leave it in the middle of the sheep pen and assume um, that they'll be fine? I feel like I'll, if I say yes, I'll be put on a list. <laughs> <Ooh>. <laughs> so, no. Definitely not. That's bad. That's bad, apparently. I, I'm judging from context that that would be a bad thing. <laughs> that would be bad. I mean, don't, if you want them to no fall in, questions. that's fine. But if you, if you don't want them to fall in, that's not, not where you'd keep them. Oh, so happy birthday to Minecraft, by the way. Oh, yeah. As we're recording this, it's 10 years old. 10 years of Minecraft. Jesus Christ. 10 years? Can you believe it? Mm, yeah. <laughs> when did you guys start playing? I can't, uh, Ten years ago. No. I think we probably started playing earlier than that because I played in the beta. About nine years ago. Is this since it was, it was about released? like half a year into development. No, it'd be ten years. It's only it was only released like four years ago or something, wasn't it? What? Like, it, wasn't it like the, the? It must be since it began. It must be ten, ten years, years since like the first beta or something. Good. It can't have yeah. been on full release ten years ago. That, that's crazy. Good. No, yeah, yeah, grief. because like. Shadow Visitor was like eight years ago, right? Yeah. And that wasn't in Final That release, was in was beta, that? wasn't it? Yeah. All right, I'm back in, guys. I'm going to... So I was going to bring you power over using immersive engineering. Is that something you'd like? Or is your power um, okay? Well, we have. We actually are generating more power than our cables can carry right now. Uh, wow. We, even, even these red ones? Uh, yeah, because I stuck like 15 windmills on the roof of the building. Oh, well, you don't need any more power then. Um, well, just you wait, <laughs> Ben, because uh, when we get, um, what's it called? Factories, that's going to up our power requirements quite a lot. Oh, okay. To be fair, I can, I can use all the power I'm making in the um, ore miner. Mine. Speaking yeah. of which, ah, yes, we have 64 plus 7 erodium crystals. Will that be enough to oh. make the tier 2 bits? Ooh. Exciting. So that's um, pretty exciting, actually, isn't it? I can make a tier two void miner. Okay, I'll work on that. Oh, okay, yeah, do that because that that was the point, wasn't it? That's what we've been. That's what we've been aiming. waiting for. All this erodium. It's taken yeah. this long to get it. Good and then grief. we can. What can we do with that? Just get loads of. We could get separate quarries up with different lenses, right? To get to mine things like the Nether, stuff like that, right? Oh so how God, I'm getting this constant litany of errors. Okay, it's gone. Um. <laughs> Uh, it it just means we'll get stuff a lot faster. Okay. I think. There might be new new ores, but I think we pretty much get everything from this one. It will give us the, the, the crystal which gets us to tier three, though. Oh. Yeah. Is it just going to need more power the more we upgrade it? Mm, possibly. <laughs> <laughs> Have you just created yourself a never-ending cycle of upgrade, build more power, upgrade, build more power? When I get the to the last time. tier, then I... Then it is not a never-ending cycle. It will end. I oh, know. No, exactly. That is the end of the cycle. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Where should I put my head? Oh. What kind of bindings do I want in this shiz? I just don't know. I bindings. guess like a paper binding and. Oh, I wouldn't worry about the bindings too much. Just pick something that you want the ability of, or pick the highest your ability that you can find. Right. Well, I do want paper binding for the extra modifier. I wouldn't worry about that. You no? get okay. shitload of modifiers Guys. from just from leveling up. Okay. Something something bad's happening here. What? What's happening? I'm just I'm finding these animals, and when I get to them, they die. Like they're just they're taking damage over time for no obvious reason. Is it you? No, they were dying when I got here. I promise. What? Where are and, you? Um, I don't know. I'm at like a big flat wasteland biome. Oh, that Nuclear might be Nuclear craft, it. wasteland. Oh, maybe they're getting, they're getting irradiated. irradiated. Oh, they're, they're getting irradiated. Are you oh getting irradiated? God. Where's the transmitter? Is that, is that gone? 
Watch out, Ben. Um, Do you have a Geiger counter on you? Because if you don't, no. you can't see. Oh, yeah, good point. Okay. Go get your Geigers. My g- Geigers. Do you have What's a radiation debuff? Uh, debuff. No, I don't. Because yeah, you could die, Ben. You could I don't want to die. I don't want to die. I'd get, I'd get away from there Of all the things, you. that's what I least want. But there's other things here too, right? It's not just an irradiated wasteland. There is a little creepy temple called an archaic light yeah, that's with probably archaic not bricks to do with it. around it. And there's like a Stonehenge. A Stonehenge? Um, a Stonehenge. A Henge. It's a Henge of some kind that's got like runes. <laughs> some kind of it. Henge. And there's a wizard here. A druid. Oh. Hello. Oh, he's creepy. Is it a rad wizard though? Ah! He's, that's the... He's super creepy. Is it the dark seen druid? This druid? Yeah. Ah! Yeah. He's killing me. Yeah, I'd get... Oh, you need him he's, for he's, the... Um, he's spooky. Between lands? Uh, yeah. You have to make yes. the pendant and then you make the tree? Yes. If you kill him enough, Ben, you get parts of like this amulet that you can complete. Yeah, you need to kill loads of them. Um, he two shots me, so... Yeah, you I'm need to get the special armor over. that we're going to make. That's right. After I do the factory, it's, it's, it's one thing becomes another becomes another with us. It? <laughs> yeah. There's like no end to it. Yeah, we're not very good at staying on target. I am going to put a, a, a waypoint here. Stay on target. How do I do that? Stay on target. Okay, it's time for sand. Uh, new waypoint. And we'll call this Creephenge. Creephenge. Here lies Creephenge. Bricks. It's creepy. Ah! He endermans at you. It's horrible. Oh, yeah. It's called teleporting, not endermaning. He endermans at me. Oh, no. I'm... <laughs> no, but it's not just teleporting. He, like, he goes behind you. It's, like, the creepiest kind of teleporting. Ew. What does he do when he's behind you? Creeps. He spooks you. He creeps at you. Oof. With creepy eyes. And then he shoots you, and you die. Okay, so I've made enough erodium bricks for the Tier 2 controller. But I'm also going to need the Tier 2 structure frames. Which is actually, I don't think I've got enough erodium steel, for God's sake. Ah, <laughs> uh, well, you get there, Duncan. It's like a whip. God's sake. In the meantime, you could actually assist with armor. Yeah. Since I'm making these factories. If you don't, if you if you kind of hit a block. Um, get it? Oh, uh, okay, I get well, it. I'm going to make the tier two controller, at least. I need some that far in. Although, I need the tier one to upgrade it. I wonder if the tier two controller will still work with the tier one blocks. Ooh. Mm. Probably not. Is there tier one, tier two blocks? Yeah, that's the problem. You you make the laser, and then you got to make the whole bloody thing again. Oh, isn't it? Isn't it lovely? Oh. It's just a stupid amount of erodium that you need. <laughs> like the parrots and the bats. What have you done, Ben? Have you got that achievement? I I bred, I bred some sheep. I told the sheep the story of the parrots and the bats, and they made a baby sheep. I remember when my mum told me about the parrots and the bats. <laughs> yeah. I was spooked at. Still confused. Why? No, why? I why do they not leave each other what alone? Sex is. <laughs> what about the birds and the bees? Is that a different story? I. Weird. Everything's different in Minecraft. Everything's a bit, a bit off, isn't it, in Minecraft? Everything's not right. Like yeah, physics kind of not really there. Only Stuff sand floats. has gravity. Only oh, and sand. gravel. <laughs> yeah. And liquid. Water has kind of a gravity, but it's slow. Is there um, a, like a clever way of breeding these quicker? Can I put down a, a block that just infinitely feeds them or something? Yeah, there is. So uh, industrial foregoing has a bunch of uh, machines that are like all geared up to automatically shear sheep, automatically breed them, automatically oh. feed them. Well, f- breeding is the feeding. Um, and yeah, you can also kill them for meat what, if you want to. What's the but- feeding thing called? Uh, I don't know. It'd be it'd be a the, the rancher. The I think the rancher shears them though. Like it'll milk cows. It'll shear sheep, um, and then a butcher will kill the animal for the meat. Um, so it might be like a breeder. A breeder will feed and breed. Feed and breed. Yeah. Oh, man. That's my, that's my what I want. Time. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I had a feed and breed. <laughs> don't know how it works exactly, but um, what the devil's in the details. <laughs> So if I just go like at in no that's not an at sign. In turns two equals sixty-four. I need sixty-four erodium. Fuck! I'm just gonna use these um, furnaces, Ben, with the rosin in to make some. Yeah, that's sand. what they're for. 
uh, into gravel, into a glass. Okay, animal feeder. We need, wow, God, golden apple, golden carrots, plastic, steel, it needs all the things. Jeez. Are Just you making the these clock, 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 spiels? Yes, I think I will, actually. I, I think might I help you with that then. Okay, well, I'm going to go and make some plates over at the smeltery. Because that's a good place to make. Oh. Oh. How do you pronounce it? I, I say cloche because clock cloch. sounds terrible. Cloch. Oh, it's a cloch. Need an engineer's <laughs> yeah. blueprint. Okay. Are you doing that? Or I, I can do that. Do no, that. it doesn't need an engineer's blueprint. It does for the vacuum tubes. Oh, and the engineer's God. Workbench. Right. Okay, so I can make everything apart from the vacuum tube, but the vacuum tube is ooh. Okay. Oh yeah, copper wire. We redstone. need treated wood, so we need um, we need to get a cold coke thing to get some cold coke oven. Some, right. Uh, what's it called? What's it called? Kerosene. Keros. No, no, creosote. Creosote. That's the one. Yeah, not kerosene. <laughs> kerosene. Very different. Might do the uh, job. Yeah, it would. Maybe. Yeah, I mean, I think if kerosene isn't solving your problem, you're just not using enough. No, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Creosote oil, we... coke. So we need a coke oven. Do we have rubber? Um, I don't think we have rubber. I'm trying to make plastic, but it's not clear how to... So for rubber, it all, all begins rubber. with these tiny chains. So rubber, we, you would have gotten a while ago, Duncan. It's how you make like latex and things. You just get like um, a block that will um, suck rubber out of tree logs. Okay, is it, but, is, like but it says, they've got any rubber, 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 rubber trees. No, it can be any tree. Mm. Oh, really? But do I specifically you... need this kind of rubber? Is like every mod got its own kind of rubber? Sometimes. Uh, what, is it, what are you making, sorry? I need plastic to make my feeder, and the plastic needs the rubber. Yeah, so for the plastic, you're going to want to make um, dry rubber, which is from tiny dry rubber, right? Yeah. And tiny dry rubber is from, wait, what? Yeah, I didn't understand. Wait, what? Lewis did this make... in ozone. There's a way to make plastic. You make it in the, you smelt it. Yeah, that's correct. From dry rubber. And you get, wait, this has changed. Oh, right, latex processing unit will make tiny dry rubber from uh, liquid latex. And you need a other thing <laughs> to actually suck from the tree. Oh, oh my God, the... this is a whole thing. It's it's a bit complicated. I just want a all... rainbow room. <laughs> uh, it's a bit of a chew, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. But those are the, 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 rub, the plastic is actually... Didn't Must I make a, a plastic, make bows? plastic surely. I thought we had plastic another way. No, we don't think we used it yet. We were going to make plastic bows, but we never did. We oh, right, yeah, because we made sure it could Okay, I'm giving up on the auto feeder. There's a latex processing unit in the computer. Is there? Yeah. What? So maybe there is also the other thing. Did we not? Oh, God. How did we. <laughs> when did we do that? So what, how do, what do I do with this latex processing unit? So that you need to put latex in, liquid latex, and you get that at industrial. Um, it's like a blue machine. Let's see if I can find it. A balloon machine. A balloon. It's a balloon. Wait, no, I can, I can just check this. So, latex. Liquid latex. And you get liquid latex in a tree fluid extractor. Uh, uh, is Duncan making those? Over uh, in his pack tree, tree farm? Uh, I've got things that suck out juice from trees, but that's what makes them more tree oil. They're, uh, they're arboreal extractors. Okay, yeah. that's different. So you can make a, a tree fluid extractor mm -hmm. pretty simply. Tree fluid extractor. Okay, so we've got four of these, Ben, and I'll oh, give them to you. amazing. Now, these, I don't think these need power, but they might do. And what you want to do is um, put four of these down. Around a tree. Around a not necessarily a tree, it just has to be a block, a log. Oh right, does it have to be a rubber tree? <laughs> and no, no, it can be any old, any old log. Uh, How does it regenerate the juice? Well, so the block Magic. breaks, so you have to put a block placer down. Oh. But I will make you a block placer because I'm that kind of guy. Wow, you're the best. What can I say? Oh, this is what Lewis was doing. Yeah, I remember now. 
He was doing that as well, was placing logs. And they were coming from a bonsai tree. Yeah. Okay, so should I pick these up and go put them over by the bonsai tree? So that makes sense. We can move a bonsai tree over to this operation. That's true. And you'll get infinite, infinite rubber, which is exactly what you want. <laughs> what? Where does... Wait, wait, floor one. Where's the actual floor? What, what? do you mean? I mean, there's no, I went to floor one to, to use some space, and then it was just it just goes outside. How do you actually get into the into uh, the room? I oh, go out and then go to the literally left. Literally pick any other floor. That's ah. the one with the... Okay, now I found it. Oh, this is like... Okay, this is like outside. Okay. okay. Yeah. Ah, the lift's gone! <laughs> I was using ah. it! <laughs> Where we going? To the top floor two. Oh no! Oh god! I'm gonna be sick. My lunch. That's my lunch. That's my lunch. 